Welcome back to the channel guys. Today we are going to be going over a Mystery Tackle Box Pro Bass Edition. And this is this month's July box. I just got this in the mail the other day. The pack is still, as you can see, I just cut this open before I left the house because I didn't have any uh, knife on me or scissors. So I did that quick. I'm on the water as you can see. So I'm hoping to be throwing these baits today as well and uh, seeing how they work for me, how they work out and hopefully catch a bunch, right? So anyways, now we're gonna open this puppy up. Okay. Okay. Some good looking stuff in there. Let's do that. All right. So as first as always, you get the what's inside the box and see what you got and what it was worth to see if you got your money's worth. Next, I will hold. Okay, so first we got the Thunderhawk mouse head grass jig. It's a quarter ounce jig in a chartreuse white color. It's a really nice uh, swim jig here. I might actually be throwing this swim jig today actually. This is perfect because this water here is dirty and I'm really want to throw chartreuse looking baits so very nice nice looking swim jig nice little streamlined head to get through the grass pretty good I like it next we have roadside minnows I've never ever tried these but I've heard enough about them okay I've heard a lot but I never tried them so today may be the day let's open these guys up this is just a uh, simple swim bait, doesn't tell me what it is. Oh, they are scented. Okay. Nice, very soft swim bait. I don't know if you see that. Look at that action. It's just super soft. You can see right through it, it's kind of translucent. Green with all kinds of rainbow colors. Yeah. Very nice looking bait. Next we have some mustad hooks. Can't ever go wrong with mustad, right? So nice, a four-aught EWG hooks there. Very nice and sharp. Some thicker ones too, thick wire. Ooh, wow, look at these. Rooster baits, I keep getting these in a lot of rooster tackle boxes. Um, no idea they existed, but I'm liking the baits more and more. So this is the Evil Twin in Green Pumpkin, okay? That's a little bit of translucent bait there. And it's a twin tail grub. And this is a very nice looking twin, twin tail grub. They're scented, and look at that. Look at that action. All kinds of action built on this bait. That's for sure. Look at that action right there. Very nice, really soft. A little bit harder, obviously, in here, which is good. Big old paddles. That's gonna go in the water. That's the Evil Twin. Next, we got some crankbaits. This is the, I don't know how you say it, Jenko or Yenko fishing. Um, they got some super nice crankbaits. This is the CD2, all right? It comes in a really sick package. It tells you everything about the bait on the back. It's a square bill, three quarter ounce bait. Look at that puppy. And let's see what color this is. Gizzard Shad, they call it. It's got blue and then kind of a purplish back. Oh, you can see that and then obviously the blue and the shad right there and that circle there that's always a good good shad mimicking part and that green chartreuse there orange belly kind of a cooler unique looking square bill to it it's almost not even square um you can hear the rattles here pretty loud right nice sharp hooks out those are sharp They're definitely sharp Nice looking eyes on those. Definitely a, a nice looking bait. That's the CD2 square bill, frankly. Next, we have Lucky Craft. Lucky Craft is uh, obviously a fishing brand. Lucky Craft, Lucky Craft lures, uh, I think, are pretty expensive. So this is the blue dream color. Blue bream, my sorry. My bad. 
and this is the CB Mighty D2RSP and it's a floating crankbait one and three quarter inch long dives at five to six feet deep and just look at how small this crankbait is this is probably killer for small mouth. look at that So it's got a blue, light blue head, obviously, you can see that. It's got a, then it leads to green and then yellow, and it's got red across the middle. It's got a red belly, nice red eyes and sharp hooks. Nice bill to it. And it tells you what lure it is on the bottom, which is cool. And something that not a lot of people notice or ever think about, you see that oval split ring on there? That allows for more action rather than what would be on this circle split ring. The oval split ring allows for more action. Then at the bottom, my favorite parts, this sticker. Big old Catchco sticker explaining their Duke and Squad rods uh, categories or their Catch Smart categories, which is hard to do. Like go to, reaction, twitch, finesse, and their muscle all categorized different stuff like those crankbaits would be in the reaction part because they react and you can peel these stickers off individually i found that out so these are really nice i got them up on all my tackle boxes uh, kind of labeling and making sense of what tackle box what here we go we got the catch smart it tells you explains it what it's about all right and then you got the dibble always a fun read Talks about flipping and pitching, some funny stuff. Talks about fishing with Becca. And then we got um, some more stuff like wading, bass lures, and catch walleye, kayak tips. I should read that, I'm in a kayak right now. So yeah, that's what's in this box. And uh, I always like to see what the most expensive item is. In the top two is that Jenko CD square bill. That's $9.99. And that Lucky Craft lure. See, I would never buy a crankbait that expensive. No way. I don't throw crankbaits that much anyways. So I would never buy one that much. But look at this. I got it in a $25, $25 box. And it came with a $15 crankbait. Look at that. Right at the top, $14.99. That is an expensive crankbait. So guys, that's it for this month's Mystery Tackle Box. Featured some awesome little crankbaits, some other nice baits, and that was July's box, Bass Pro. Hopefully um, next month's box is like maybe some more topwater baits. We had that last month. See what we get in August. Um, pick one up for yourself. Look at the link in the description. I, you can save $10 off your first Mystery Tackle Box using my link in the description. And if you also want to set up the Carl's Bait Tackle, you can save 30% off on all of your tackle. I was hesitant at first, I know, but guess what? I've saved hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of dollars on tackle. Probably oh, close to a thousand. I'm serious with the percent off. It's, it's insane. And it's all free shipping. Even if I just bought this little guy, free shipping. That's, to me, shipping is a pain. I hate paying for shipping. And Carl's, free shipping. So check it out guys check out the mr tackle box if you haven't already and leave a comment like and hit that bell down in the corner subscribe and i'll see you guys next time